Hey guys, this is Versatile from VST Power, now hosted on the Money Phoenix channel. In today's video game tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can create the spark again to play Halo 2 PC online using the Tungle program and the Techno Gods program. You could play on official real servers, but Microsoft killed those servers off in February 2013. So if you want to play this game, you got to do this alternate method and it works out fine. If you go into the more info section, I have a link where you can download the Techno Gods program and then also where you can get, download the latest patches for this game. If you go into the Tungle program and go to the Halo 2 room, you can also see the Tungle wiki at the question mark or the don't panic button. However, please note that this wiki is sort of outdated because it's referencing instructions and steps for an older version of the Techno Gods program, but let me show you how it works the correct way in case the Tungle Wiki or whatever ever gets screwed up in the future. So what you do is install Halo 2, go ahead, download, install the games for Windows Live client and, and um, install it and sign in and run it. So here it is in the background. Go ahead and download the Techno X Live program. And then after that, join the Halo 2 network, start the Techno Gods helper, and then follow the rest of this video tutorial. So here I am. So let's go ahead, and what I did was I extracted the technohelper.exe into my Halo 2 folder. You don't have to. You can do it in the desktop, wherever you want to. So what I'm going to do is, you can see that it automatically detected I'm running the Tungo adapter. Sweet. And then uh, you could also click here, set adapter key. Oops, let me click on here. Now click set adapter key. Okay, great. Now you click on play. Okay. And now what you want to do is literally double click your Halo2.executable, start your game, Go inside your game, and then when you're at that network menu looking for games, this will already be a green check mark. And then when you join someone else's game, this will also be a green check mark. So, with that said, let's jump straight into the gameplay footage tutorial. All right, so let's do this. So, we just started Halo 2. I'm sort of booting up the game right now, and momentarily, it's going to prompt you for this uh, sign into the games for Windows Live. So, I got an offline account. So, let's go ahead and log into that real quick here. And then we'll go ahead and show you that proof that, yeah, this does work. One of the things you can do is you press the home key, make sure you go to the settings, network information, and that's how you can confirm that your game is using Tungo. Another check you can do is go to settings over here, go to network, and we see it's using the Tungo adapter. Awesome. So let's go to network here. And I know this guy, his game was working earlier, so let's go ahead and see if I can join this game again. Sometimes when you join other people's game, it might give you an error message about, sorry, you can't join this guy's party. I don't know why it does that, if that's an issue. See, just like that. So what I'm going to do is go back and click it again and again until I can get in. Some of the matches you can't get in because of whatever. Notice that we heard that sound there, so that was the Techno Gods program working in the background. Sometimes you might try to join other people's servers that you can never join. I don't know why it does that, maybe because the guy's game version, I have no idea. So just continue to try, or if you want to host your own game, just go ahead and create your own game. And I died, what the hell. If you want to chat, press F1, you can do whatever, I'm going to do a smiley face. And that's pretty much it. Come on! Oh my god, beat down. But yeah, you can clearly see there's a lot of uh, players still playing Halo 2 right now. There's a lot of Spanish players, but hopefully with this video, we'll get a lot more gamers interested in this game like the golden days, the good old times. And that's pretty much it. If you guys got any nitpicky questions, leave a comment here on the YouTube page. I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Once again, thank you for watching. Take care. Bye.